Drowsiness and driver distraction have become serious road safety issues. The National Highway Traffic Safety Administration estimates that drowsy driving causes more than 100,000 crashes each year, resulting in 40,000 injuries and 1,500 deaths. Professional drivers, truckers, and operators of heavy machinery are at even higher risk of accidents related to sleepiness and fatigue due to the tight deadlines and long hours at the wheel. I'm here at the ICOM Lab Drive Simulator today to show you how the EC7T system can detect drowsiness in drivers. You'll see that the EC7T allows me to blink naturally, but as soon as my eyes close for a longer period than normal, a two-stage alarm alerts me to my sleepiness or distraction. The EC7T is based on a sophisticated oculometric sensor that detects the signs of drowsiness before you fall asleep. When the eyes are closed for too long, the alarm intensifies, increasing in tone and volume until it wakes you up. This alert can also be sent back to a dispatch office if the driver was working for a trucking company. The EC7T system can be used to detect fatigue in other fields such as air traffic control, plant management, and security. The U.S. Department of Transportation defined a new metric called per close the percentage of time the eyes are open or closed as the best biophysiological measure of drowsiness. When I developed the ICOM system, I realized that it could measure not only purposeful blinks, but long drowsy blinks, and convert those blinks into signals that could be used to alert a sleepy driver. The ICOM 7T has now evolved into a new biosensor communicator and controller which can turn on all kinds of alarms to alert a sleepy driver as well as anyone in the vicinity who might be able to wake the driver up. And this includes dispatching stations which could be monitoring fleets of trucks with drivers who might have the possibility of falling asleep at the wheel causing a catastrophic accident.